the level of controversy surrounding uh, the voter ID law, uh, all the twists and turns, all the litigation, all the ups and downs, uh, the suits, the trial, the decisions uh, being made uh, by, uh, by the judge, I think drove a lot of attention and focus on the issue of voting, one. Two, I think that, uh, at least here in Philadelphia, uh, we tried to do our best to make sure that people actually knew the president's record. And three, I think that, um, you know, 2008 was a very special year for a lot of us. Uh, you know, I'm born, raised, educated, created all my trouble here in Philadelphia. This is my town. I'm a very proud African-American, and I think a lot of people, black, white, Latino, Asian, uh, uh, took great pride uh, in electing uh, President Obama uh, in 2008. I think for all the garbage, all the nonsense, uh, all the attacks, all the abuse, all the disrespect uh, that has been heaped on uh, President Obama in the midst of the worst recession since the Great Depression and the things that he has done, financial recovery, health care, end of the wars, dealing with uh, Osama bin Laden and taking him out, rescuing the auto industry. The list goes on and on and on. And I think ultimately a lot of folks uh, were really pissed uh, about uh, how the president uh, has been attacked, disrespected, uh, and uh, wanted to express themselves in a very direct fashion and came out in droves yesterday uh, to support uh, someone who actually deserved uh, to be reelected. Uh, and so I think it was a different level of pride uh, that uh, drove a whole bunch of voters, not just African Americans, uh, to the polls yesterday, certainly here in Philadelphia, throughout Pennsylvania, and all across the United States of America. So, you know, people have whatever they have in their hearts and their minds uh, on an election, uh, but uh, I think that that issue has now been uh, resolved. And what's most important, uh, it goes back to something I said earlier, um, you know, the election's over. It's time for governing. Uh, it's my hope uh, that Washington uh, will figure out a way, the President working with the Congress, the House and the Senate, Democrats and Republicans, uh, Republicans will figure out how to now start working together on behalf of the American public to put Americans uh, back to work. And it really is time to start governing, cut out a lot of the nonsense, and make things happen.